I know a lot of you guys are going back to school and all that, so I decided that I would kind of make a video about my school experiences. Um, now, I wasn't really like fantastic in school, like I'm not even gonna lie, I failed miserably. I hated doing homework. I literally only went to school just to talk to my friends and to write because I didn't have paper so I was like, oh, I'm gonna steal a crap load of paper and write stories. Um, so that again ties in with my story writing now. Um, but like I didn't hate school. I was a teacher's pet. Like I would constantly talk to my teachers and be like buddy buddy with them. So I would never get in trouble for the stuff I would do. Um, I know I did a lot of skipping. I hung out with a lot of bad people, bad friends. Um, even my own boyfriend, at, like when I was dating this guy in ninth grade, had me skipping at one point. Um, and then we had like gone out and he was like, one of his friends was like forcing drugs on me. And I'm just like, whoa, no, no, thank you. I'm good. I don't do drugs. It's not my thing. Um, so I was like, I was skipping constantly and we no I never did anything bad. I just hung out with friends. That's what I wanted to do. I just wanted to talk. I just, I'm very, I need brain stimulation kind of person. Like I can't just sit in my room for days on end and just be a blank slate. Um, so there was that. So I was kind of bad. Um, like my school experiences were a lot of let's go hang out and chat in the hallways and walk around and stuff like that. Um, I never really was bullied, um, so I don't really have any bullying stories. I know a lot of people didn't like me because I was the goth kid in school. Um, so, you know, I had my little clique of people I hung out with and that was it. And everyone else kind of was like, oh God, like, go away, please just leave. Like, you're weird. Um, so... I was, I was bullied in that sense, but I wasn't really, like, bully bullied. Um, so, yeah, I don't know. Um, I know you guys aren't allowed to carry backpacks in school anymore, or to class, or whatever. For whatever reason, because I was such a teacher's pet, um, I used to carry a messenger bag around all the time. I had all my books in it. It had everything in it. And I don't know because I was a teacher's pet or because I, they knew I wasn't going to do anything malicious in the school. They were just kind of like, oh, it's just Heather, whatever. Let her do whatever she wants. Or it's just because they didn't care. Um, so I would carry a messenger bag around and I would bring my coat to class and all that stuff. So I don't know. Now, some other crazy stories um I got suspended that was that was middle school um we could talk about that story if you want give it a thumbs up if you want to hear about how I got suspended um I did get detention a couple times um the one time I got detention was um was because um I don't know if this teacher was having a bad day or if I set him off or something but usually we were pretty cool with each other. Um, I think I had, was talking in class and just being disrespectful. And I'm like, yeah, okay, talking is disrespectful. Don't get me wrong. Um, but so he wrote me up for that. And then I like, I was talking back because I was like, that's like, that's wrong. I didn't do anything wrong. Like I was just mad because he was tr like, just in a bad mood that day or something. I have no idea. Um, and then he was like, you're wearing pajama pants. And I'm like, I wear pajama pants all the time. Like, there was full on plaid, like red plaid pajama pants. So, I don't know what to tell you. I guess I got, should have gotten in trouble for that a long time ago, but I didn't. So, he wrote me up for that. And then he was, he got really mad and then was like, you're not supposed to have a backpack in class. And I'm like, I've been carrying this backpack around for two years. 
well, not the same backpack, but I was carrying a messenger bag around for two years. Um, so he wrote me up for that too. So I got three detentions in one day, in one class, in all a matter of five minutes. So, oops. Um, but it wasn't that bad because I talked to the principal and he was like, oh, just have one detention. I don't care. Go away. Because again, teacher's pet. Um, so I got off easy with that one. Um, I did have one Saturday school. I don't remember what for. Um, I don't know. I'll have to ask my mom and find that out. Because I don't remember why I had Saturday school. <laughs> um, but yeah, so I mean, like, I wasn't a terrible kid in school. I just... I didn't like to do stuff or whatever and I would just do whatever I wanted and talk and that was about it. Um, another time where I was not misbehaving but the teacher didn't like what me and my friend were doing so um, me and this girl, she was bisexual so you know I was like whatever you're cool. Um, and I didn't have a problem with that, but my teacher did, and we were walking to class with their, with holding hands and stuff, and, um, I didn't say anything wrong with it, but she did, and I'm like, we're, we're just friends, like, you know we're friends, I don't know what the problem is, um, so we, we kind of got a little offended by it, so we were like, oh, let's just hold hands. The rest of the class just to make this teacher mad because we were dumb and I think we were like 17. Um, so she ended up call finding out her parents' numbers and calling her parents and my friend's mom was like, I don't care, let my child do whatever she wants, um, kind of thing. And then my mom was like, you're calling to interrupt my day to tell me that my daughter was holding hands with her friend to class. Like, I don't know if this teacher was, like, homophobic or whatever, or she just didn't like us. I don't know. But I'm like, dude, we're friends. Like, get, like, get out of my face, please. Like, you have, you're just, no. Go. Um, but yeah, so I've had some crazy homophobic teachers, teacher, um, in my class, classes, I don't know what I'm talking about, um, I've also basically because I was friends with teachers got to pass classes, um, I had one teacher who I have had ever since middle school, um, I had her in like 6th grade, 7th grade, 8th grade, she disappeared ninth. In 10th grade and then 11th and 12th grade I had her again and because I know I've known her so for so long and I've helped her and I've bought her gifts and um you know I was there for her dog's funeral and I supported her and all that stuff um she basically gave me an A on everything and I passed the class two years in a row I mean I was I did I actually did stuff in her class because I liked her, but she also, like, kind of was like, I know you're a good kid, blah, blah, blah. Good for me. Um, but yeah, like, I don't really know any other crazy stories. Um, like I said, I failed school, got my GED. Um, so yeah, that was today's video. I hope you guys all enjoyed that. Give me a thumbs up and subscribe for school videos. I don't know. <laughs> I'll see you guys all tomorrow. Bye!